lashes. Custom RC car stuff. X Maxes and the big ones here. Infinity RX fabrication. We weld in some plate at the yeah. same angle. That is crazy. time you guys welcome back to the Carl the Crusher channel and I'm at Infinity Arcs welding down in Las Vegas and the Crusher car is done check this out this is so cool I can't believe how this turned out and you can see all the amazing weld jobs so Riley tell us what you did here check all this custom stuff out so it was pretty fun to build um, the hardest part was figuring out a way to make a metal shell fit onto a polymer chassis. Right. Uh, but basically, we just used some of the mounting points at the bottom here. Uh, just built a little bracket that rests against the whole front. There's some little bolts that go into a little uh, attachment point back here. And then there's a uh, detachable front end so we can make all kinds of fun things to put on the oh, front yeah. here. So this will come off and on and exactly. we can like put yeah. a blade or all kinds of cool oh, stuff yeah. on we, it. Pretty much anything you can think of we can attach to the front here. And then uh, this whole shell, this is all steel. Um, that's an old motorcycle fender. Uh, it's got some crazy looking spikes and then we just guarded the internals with some steel ribs. Yeah, that should protect it really well, like all the internal components and stuff. Yeah, it should. Uh, guard all the important stuff at least. And then there's just a little bracket back here just to pop it on and off. So. so crazy. Yeah. So I've got some stuff we can put it to the test if you want to go out in the desert. Yeah. That we can drive it through and do a whole test run and see how it holds up. I got a watermelon, some balloons. If you guys want to see all the behind the scenes action of how the Crusher car was actually welded and put together, make sure and go to Infinity R. You have a whole YouTube channel. I'll put it in the links down below. It's like solid and actually really sharp. Be, watch your step around this <laughs> yeah. thing. Don't trip and fall. Yeah. <laughs> like, look at that. That's for real. <laughs> What's more is we have a bunch of awesome upgrades in the welding shop here. A bunch of new tools and opportunities to do custom cool projects. Got awesome sanders, a drill press. Oh, the sneak peek. I'm not, oh, I'm not gonna show you that yet. That's a surprise. I have like a bandsaw and Riley made this cool little petroglyph dude. He's like an Ant-Man. It's gonna go back in my office or on my desk for all my Carl Vine podcasts. He's so cool, check him out. It is time to put the new RC Crusher car to the test. We're gonna ram it through all kinds of cool stuff. But first of all, we're gonna just test the little pokey blades with a bright red balloon. <laughs> Let's just check it out and see if it pops up. Oh my gosh, and the <laughs> echo was so freaking loud. Oh my gosh. I was like, ping! Did you hear that? Yeah. Like the echo off this canyon. Wow, that was so loud. Instantly popped. I don't even know if the camera caught that. It was so was fast. fast. <laughs> Let's do one more and I'll slow-mo it. We've got the blades all lined up and everything all set to go. And first up is the beach ball. So we're gonna go on easy mode for our first run in this really awesome like post-apocalyptic zone where everybody comes out here and like shoots their trash and stuff in the desert. But we're gonna use the crusher car and do some ramming tests here. All right, first up, the beach ball. Ready? Three, two, one. I endoed <laughs> trying to stop. That's no good. Very first test run, I totally flipped over and just pushed the beach ball out of the way. I think the only thing you got hurt is the GoPro. <laughs> Alright, we're golden. <laughs> oh, is it still alive? Yeah, we're good. Okay. <laughs> Look at it, it's solid. Oh, yeah. Didn't dent it or anything, just flipped it over. Alright, well let's do it again. Next up, we've got the beach ball cornered, but this time against a thick inch piece of foam wedged up between these boulders. So we're going to try and aim perfectly in the middle because if I uh, go to one side or the other, I might bash into a boulder and crush the crusher car. We'll find out. Let's give it a shot. So far, it's holding up awesome. It even endowed and flipped over and no damage. 
to the blades or anything. And so I think as we get bigger and bigger, we might even try and go through a two by four. It's gonna be really fun. I've gotta be really careful with my aim on this one. You ready? Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Yeah! I, I definitely rammed through it. And look, look, the ball. We did it. The ball is completely popped. There's holes going through the ball right there. So the beach ball is done. Let's flip the foam board over and see what we did. Whoa, look at that. Oh, yeah. That's where the three blades hit. <laughs> the tires. The tires. <laughs> and then just totally slammed it out. Let's do double foam board so we have two layers now. Oh, now we've got double walled foam board. We're gonna wedge balloons in between it as spacers. We got one trying to escape here and I don't blame it because it's probably not gonna survive. We'll put them down there in the bottom. And this time, Riley, you gotta do the driving. Oh no. And I'm okay. just gonna film. So just make sure and go right in the middle. It's <laughs> harder than you think. And we'll see how many balloons you get. And if you get all the way through the foam board. Oh, we'll see you in a second. <laughs> And don't swerve off and ram into my shins either. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be awesome. Oh, yeah! <laughs> that totally went all the way through. first piece of foam board totally split it all the way out i think we have a couple of escapey balloons we better catch really quick but that was total annihilation on that one the crusher truck is surviving everything so far this is probably the one i'm most excited about so far we got the crusher car versus the mighty watermelon down there at the end of the road and we have a big running ahead start in order to try and see what we can do smashing through it okay here we go and three two one Whoa! i think i drove oh. right over the top of it i flipped up like a huge chunk of wood into the air too That was crazy. Did I even hit the watermelon? Yeah. Oh, Whoa. Oh, you hit it. I totally hit it. hit it. Look at that. Wow. Oh, it's completely Com in there. Yeah. Sliced all the way in. I think one more good hit and that's coming apart. Oh my gosh. Look, and how's the car look? Oh no, you're tired. Oh, tired. <laughs> the tire's gone. Look at that, shredded. So that's the one weakness. We shredded the front right tire, but the crusher car itself, totally in, untacked and unfazed. I don't know why this feels like some kind of like Ninja Turtles test. And so we got a board breaking right here with the two by four followed up with the watermelon. So we're gonna see if we can smash through that with the crusher car on the first try, do or die. And it's a narrow target. If I swerve left or right, I might end it on one of those rocks, but let's find out. This is the grand finale. I'm actually a little bit nervous about this one because so far every other run up there, it's really swimmy. It's kind of like sandy and gravelly and big rocks mixed in. It's not the smoothest runway, so hopefully I can keep it straight. There's only one way to find out. Are you ready? Okay, let's do it. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh, here we go.
I can't believe I aimed that well and got it. And then I even hit the watermelon again. Let's check it out. Look, completely split through. I might've jumped over the top. Let's check out the truck. Did it survive? It's perfect. No damage. Oh my gosh, this is the coolest thing ever. I think that the first day of Crusher Car Challenges was a huge success. The only thing... <laughs> Something just broke the sound barrier overhead, but I don't know. <laughs> anyway, we're in the Nevada desert. You never know out here. But the Crusher Car was awesome, you guys. Make sure to subscribe, turn on notifications, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.